The St. Louis region remains a hot spot for cases. St. Louis County had the largest increase in cases over the last two weeks of any Missouri County. A nurse from our area served patients on the other side of the state, and now she is a patient. 41 Action reporter Dan Cohen pulling double duty for us tonight. Vicki Arrowwood's 29-year-old daughter Ashley is working her way through nursing school and answered the call to help treat COVID-19 patients in St. Louis. She felt that that was something she needed to go do and she wanted wanted to do it, so she's, she's headstrong. She does what she wants to do. But when Ashley came home to the Metro, she fell ill. She came home and started asking if her lips were blue. And I said, yeah, they do have a blue tinge to it. And that's when she went to the hospital. And that's she was admitted then. Ashley contracted COVID-19 and has been on a ventilator for more than a week. Vicki has been in quarantine too. She tested positive for the virus and hasn't seen her daughter since she was hospitalized. She still is at home with me. It's been her and I since her dad died. Her dad died when she was 10 and stuff. And it's just her and I, and I can't go see her. I can't, can't you know, pat her on the arm or anything or let her know that I'm there. So that's... That's the bad part. Family and friends have rallied to the Arrowwood side, raising more than $18,000 on a GoFundMe page and doing much more. And I've had friends bring and family bring food over and sit out on the steps for me. I've had family and friends bring dog food and cat food and sit out on the front steps for me and just the outpouring has just been amazing. Vicki knows Ashley has a long road ahead and is looking forward to seeing her go back to nursing and a specialty honoring Ashley's late father. And he was in need of a kidney transplant too. And that's that's something she wanted to do was she worked with kidney transplants. That was what she wanted to do and her goal. In Kansas City, Dan Cohen, 41 Action News.